I do need to kind of go at least another, you know, kind of midway into the yellow there, um, where it's still in the ball, in that little circle of the ball. You'll see that little circle, circular there. You do got to just keep it there. Now, with this one, the ball guide is going to want to collapse down. So you, you may crank your backspin. You can see it looks like the ball guide is going through the hole, but it should collapse down a little bit. And I'm going to play just enough rings. And you can see that's why my opponent's short, is because he wasn't really anticipating the ball guide collapsing down. So these are the type of things that you want to be thinking about. And that's where, you know, experience and just knowing kind of the way it's going to play out and that it's going to collapse down. If I get my ultimate, you know, this is an easy win. So, you know, once you guys learn how to play these shots, um, you know, they're pretty straightforward. And, uh, you know, with a tailwind, we're just going to have to play a little bit different. We're going to have to land basically where my opponent did. So with a tailwind, he landed perfect. But with a headwind, he landed, you can see he's a yard and a half short. It's like a significant change between headwind and tailwind. So you got to make sure that you know how to do both. So keep that in mind. Good luck. I'll see you guys on the